I V M. Hello, hello, Amit. I won't be able to record today, yar. Arey, why? What happened, Cyrus? Ah, oh, man, I've got to do go to the bank. I have to open a new account. That document filing, profiling. You got to show this card, that card, this verification, that verification. Too many processes. Man, they should have to ease these things up, yar. There's no way a normal person can do this. Well, there is a way to do this. All you have to do is you can do all of this sitting at home if you have a Bank of Baroda account. Huh? But I have a Bank of Baroda account. Awesome. Then all you really need to do to avail of 95% of all retail banking services domestically, just download the Bob World app and use the banking services right at your fingertips. Oh, wow! Sorted. See you in the studio then. What a relief! Bank of Baroda. We live in your world. Kripaya, dear DJ, the language used on the podcast may not be fit for consumption. We warn you, tread carefully. But listen, yar, don't be so conservative. Begin this day with very sad news. Uh, one is, of course, this podcast is live now. But even worse than that, tragic news from Pakistan: Shahid Afridi, known as Lala Adher at Boom Boom across the Western world, has finally retired. Well, retired for the eighth time, but uh, officially, this is it. He now has retired from Tests, uh, One Days, T20, T10, and PSL. There's nothing left. He cannot even play club cricket. He says his body is in too much pain, and he's not sure of his age, whether he's 41 uh, according to the Pakistan Cricket Board or 48. According to his own biography, if you do the maths and add the years that were given there, uh, whatever it is, he's done. He's finished. And I want to show some respect for one of uh, I would never call him great, but definitely one of the cricketers who changed the face of cricket. Uh, he brings in a different style of dynamic batting, which Jay Surya himself, uh, to some extent, and then of course Gale, Shehwag, David Warner, and the list goes on to the modern uh, openers across the world. All this came from that era of Shahid the Fridi when he was 16 or 17 or 18 or 19 or 20, 21, 22, whatever that age is, never clear. When he made that 102 ball, uh, 102 or 40 balls or 36 ball 100, 37 ball 100, which was a world record then. So great and sad moment for us. Uh, I hope uh, prime ministers of both countries uh, at least spend a little time wishing him well because he was a great entertainer. And here's the irony for cricket lovers because we have a cricket lover and a half, one and a half cricket lovers on the show coming on in a minute. The irony of the whole thing is I interviewed Bob Bulmer. Who sadly passed away for a news channel which I shouldn't mention called NDTV, and I remember asking him who's the best defensive batsman in uh, the Pakistan team. This was 2004-5, and he said the best player of the forward defence and actually the batsman the best defence is Afridi, and that's with Yusuf Yohana and Yunus Khan in the team and Inzamam and all these uh, other other greats. So that's the irony: most attacking batsman, but also the most defensive. Sometimes it feels like all the weight of the world has fallen onto my shoulders, and it usually happens on my downtime while I'm enjoying a nice game of cricket. It's like my family realizes that I'm watching cricket and they just rush to ruin it for me. Then my mom will come in ranting about some problem with the neighbors. My wife will come in shouting about how we need to redo our kitchen, plus also some problem with the neighbors. And my daughter will come in angry at me because the color of the new car we bought is not what she had wanted, which is apparently the biggest crime a father can commit. Plus, of course, some problem with the neighbors. Hmm. Ah, if only things could be just the same, even if something were to happen to me. Unless www.hdfclife.com select select done. Hmm. Things aren't so bad after all. Live calm with HDFC Life. Click to protect life. The Life Protect option protects your family from financial uncertainty. Visit hdfclife.com to know more and for terms and conditions. This brings us to our program. We have the most attacking and most defensive people on this program. We have Puneet Panya, who's fresh from the success of 105 sh- uh, shows across India, and 10, 15 of them people attended. But the government didn't allow other ones to attend, so it's not his fault. Uh, <laughs> we also have Mr. Ganguly, who's, who's back after a long time, and hopefully will not spend such a long time away from us. Uh, who's He's completed. Uh, there's a tragedy of his own that he wants to tell us about about models misbehaving in his colony and in his building <laughs> society. We'll come to that in a minute. And we have Silvery, who after one day, Puneet Abhijit, one day he attended the office in the month of February. Two. Now back <laughs> two, two. to buy mummy's food. Everything is cool, rocking. 
so and of course poor amit has to continue with this work from home but he's grinding his teeth because he doesn't really mean it anymore <laughs> you're not supposed to actually you're supposed to actually come to office now uh welcome to this horrible show thank you so much for coming here obviously you couldn't get any other gig uh, for this morning fair look enough. at these two they're looking also so comfortable you know chilling in bed and all like we are the only one who are actually sitting in a chair i'll tell you like, abhiji i'm it's sitting because in a chair. our show is like the yeah. opposite of an exam nobody oh. feels anxiety or uh, any need to perform or rise above or you know nobody has that feeling it's like almost like you're lying in bed and playing with a remote control or yourself <laughs> whichever one is your the thing to do for the day wait puneet do i look like i'm sitting Abu? on a bed because i'm sitting in a chair because i i, I thought that's like that's chair. an extension yeah, it's of a framing. bed like from behind oh yeah. the framing oh it's sorry framing. sorry for putting you on the spot i thought you're, I thought you're sitting on the floor but in oh, your okay. house because you're the junior <laughs> you're not allowed on a chair don't don't do that antarekshi even that pressurize puneet also to do it and i know for sure that he's wearing boxers he's not wearing pants or something even okay. yeah he's definitely not wearing pants puneet is so, doing yeah. two podcasts he's playing the tabla on one and then he comes back here so he's in the right position for everything <laughs> Puri? I don't have a workstation because I believe in live shows and not online content all the time. This is a live show. So we are we are pleasing both your requirements. Live and live online. Show, yeah, correct. The live, live show, show just because nobody watches our show doesn't mean it's not live. Please don't be disrespectful. <laughs> no, no, don't when I say live, I mean you can everything. catch COVID from the audience and give it back to them. That is That's how we are defining live as now. <laughs> like it's just COVID. Now, by friendly. now you haven't. If you haven't got COVID, you'll you'll, you'll stick out like a loser or something. No, Mila. I haven't. You know, imagine, I haven't. How many years have passed? It's weird, but. Uh, but yeah. you are right it feels i haven't had it and it feels weird now i like i yeah. like when they talk about like covid i don't have anything to contribute on yeah you missed like, out on an experience that. i could have had exactly yeah. i have guys I, that i, I know who had three covids they're like boss <laughs> catch up yaar <laughs> yeah. like no I'm sharing dude ask him to share a I little know, bit what oh, is selfish yeah yeah i i've Amazing. been across the country three four times in the last one year i've been to langars also on guru purab day no covid And oh, that's fully packed. Right? Really packed. <laughs> like, yeah, really trying. Fully packed. Like, yeah, really. At one point, you know, we're trying get to get bothered. Like, what is wrong? Is something wrong with us? Why are we not getting <laughs> this thing? Everybody has, man. Like, Did you all understand the uh, poignant meaning of his conversation here? Puni explained. Uh, he was talking about COVID and explained to you how he doesn't spend money on food. I think that was the important point that he <laughs> he's trying to tell us, which I appreciate more than the health requirement. Too much. We consumerism has changed India too much. Too many people want to spend too much money on too many things. I like that thinking. You go yeah. to a guest house at the at the right time, twelve forty five. Punch. He has to say he khana khayega, and you know it's just always always keep that in your head. Uh, but we've but got the, very. But the day show. I went to the langar last time, Sairaj, it was Guru Purab day. It was very crowded in Delhi, Chandni Chowk Gurudwara. In the same day evening, I was performing in the most fine dining restaurant in Delhi also because there are two which, India. Which restaurant is this? Uh, uh, home, home, PVR. Oh yeah, yeah. It's, they make a killer whiskey, oh, sir. Yeah, and uh, they have whale <laughs> tongue on the menu. They have what? A whale can... tongue. Whale tongue. Yeah. Like the. Machi. That's not really whale. That's But not. But do really they have the rest of the whale? <laughs> Why are you bringing no. the hijab into it? Do not bring the hijab into this conversation. What are you talking about? <laughs> There's no yeah, whale tongue on homes menu. Please put it. And Wait, not on. after the pandemic anymore. But they did have it. Hey, you know who takes the whale tongue? No, the blue whale. The orca. Uh, it submits to the what orca do you mean? and no, allows the orca is... to take the whale tongue. Okay, so I thought it meant something else. What you were saying, like who takes the tongue from the whale? <laughs> well, if fish is what gets you off, brother, in bed, then what the hell? Get an aquarium. <laughs> Bengali man, get there's a Bengali. Fish. There's a Bengali joke there somewhere. I'm pretty yeah. certain. Yeah, yeah. I have a lovely Bengali story actually. I'll I'll tell you. It will take too long about Singapore, which we are coming to in a bit, and the aquarium. Those colorful fish there. So what are we starting with, Silvery? Okay, we are starting with. Some, Should we ask them uh, what they are doing? But first. Little yeah, bit we haven't yes, met either of them for some time. Puneet's been hiding. Firstly, sure. we tried to get yeah. him for Republic Day. He didn't refuse to come. Uh, he was. I know Puneet has been coming out of town. Yeah. Huh? Republic Day, I was uh, in Lucknow of all places. Of course, was, uh, campaigning uh, yes. for Yogi Bhai. Oh, Fair enough. What's yeah. with you rubbing your hands across your thighs <laughs> while you say that? <laughs> When you mentioned sexual titillation <laughs> with the uh, <laughs> with the uh, with the fish and all that, I think things have changed uh, drastically after that. God. It's He a brave shaking. new world. I'm I'm learning new new term. There's a new form of relationship called situationship. Mm. Just learned yeah, it. Yeah, correct. Last night. And I just learned. Explain. Right. Situation meaning you happen to be in a place where uh, is comfortable, and then there's nothing after that. So it's just convenience. 
And they call so it basically, you're not ex- basically like you've been yeah. together for years and years. Okay, so you're basically you're hooking up, you're having sex, whatever. The, what a regular couple does, but you don't want to label it as a relationship. Okay, right? So you don't want to be the regular couple doesn't have sex and call it exclusive. You know. But Antarik, so uh, sorry for uh, being in a situation. Yeah, wasn't please, this called polyamorous relation? I because I yeah. distinctly no. remember hearing the same definition that is for polyamorous. If, no, yeah. polyamorous yeah. is if if you have multiple partners also. This is not about having multiple partners. You have the same partner, but you're but not calling it a relationship. Ex- you but are in a situation. It's not exclusive. To. It's exclusive. He's not, it's not exclusive. Not, not necessarily. So no. a bit of a situation going. Uh, that's no, what in it's polyamorous, called. you have multiple partners and they all play Ludo yeah. with each other on Saturdays. <laughs> that's polyamorous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, correct, correct. That's it. This one, there's the so snakes and ladders. Situ- in this situ- one. <laughs> situation ship is only one-on-one or it's uh, not one-on-one? It's, it's not one-on-one. It's one-on-one. It is one on one means for, those, for on that particular. Uh, you could have yeah. multi multiple situations with other people if you are in many situations. But uh, where do we get that, uh, regulations from the home ministry? Who do we apply to? I mean, to clear, no, clarify no, everything. Yeah, it's like and demonetization, you, Cyrus. Every day there's a new yeah. circle. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah, comes out but, and you know so gives why a stand in line for situation ship you have to stand in line also so i don't want to do that boss this is not fun bus bus uh, feed defines the rules so they come out with circular so it's like it's bus not more about having companionship than being in an actual relationship Aray, that's why you have that's male friends no baba same sex <laughs> gender is for you companionship want, you want and uh, friday night also. saturday night used to be for the other but whatever no i don't know the genders are mixed it's a very unclear situation but, but there's uh, no uh, commitment so so, so there's no commitment the even in situationship yeah. and even in polyamorous. Also in marriage. Situationship, yeah? there's, situationship, there's an understanding, but there's no like I don't know. Actually, I don't know, man. What it what? I, Are you in a situationship? Uh, is anyone in a situationship? Uh, no, I'm not. Sadly, I think so, but you can't be sure anymore. So you don't know if you are. Yeah, it's yeah. It's, like could a relationship, <laughs> but because you know, from your situ- side, it could be a proper relation. From the other side, it is a yeah. situation. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Good point. Yeah. Good point. Each one has their yeah. own perspective. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. like how molestation so, for one is love for the other. I understand what you're saying. Wow. I've been to Gurugram. Also, <laughs> say on a bad day. On a bad day, <laughs> on a bad day huh? Huh? say some one of the one of the parts gets pissed. Right? Can a relationship then become a situationship? Like Sharveen has given you a very important example. Please look at this. Yeah, correct. Yeah, that is true. That is true. But we, we don't have, have any uh, physical with. contact. Thank God for that. Uh, yeah. So <laughs> then, then it's very <laughs> non-COVID friendly. <laughs> non-COVID. Then my life is filled with situationships, yeah. yeah. With non-physical contact, I have two thousand people. It's ridiculous. <laughs> too many situations. But let's talk to Abhijit about his life now, since uh, Puneet is not sharing except for Lucknow and what he did there. Situationships. Situationships. <laughs> yeah. No, no. My Abhijit, what's I, been I, going on? Just same old. Uh, I mean, we are right now just waiting for lockdown to end properly. But uh, as we were talking about, uh, you know, the building things, and probably we can go from there to Faridabad buildings also. Uh, as I put, tweeted I out just, yesterday, uh, put up his picture. There's a nice picture on his uh, <laughs> Twitter account or Insta. I can't remember, but. Uh, while while he's talking, if you can just fire, where's it? Where's incidentally, it? incidentally, that on? picture was uh, is not even something I clicked. I got it on the uh, on uh, you know the Sherwood Gals. That's a WhatsApp group of the females in uh, of the society <laughs> called Sherwood Gals. Sherwood Gals. Oh man. Yeah, and, and, and the gals are Pachpan, Saat, Asi. Yeah. <laughs> fair, fair enough. Yeah, yeah, yeah of course, absolutely. Somebody, yeah. Yeah, yeah, and somebody click, clicked the picture of what is this going on? You know, like there's some model, some mod, and it's a picture of some girl like like some so around the club. Area, some uh, model shoot was going on, and uh, and then because of that, there was a shoot going on. All the men, the husbands are going like three, four times. I just said basically. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. One like as you were saying, one one करके एक आलू. Next visit में दूसरा आलू. Third visit में तीसरा आलू. So very. Uh, what is what which which alcohol brand is that? Pyar ki ra me chalna si kind of vibe. Ah, nice, men will be nice. men. Ah, so these are the ah, models, yeah. ah, by the way. Uh, no, that's the model. The, the other people are the model people. Is oh, sorry, yeah, because but but you. Yeah. you so it's not a this? TikTok shoot, huh? Not a TikTok shoot. Not a TikTok but, but guys, shoot. No. There, so yeah. there are two types of things you do when there's this kind of things happening. One is the person who stares, or the person who pretends they're not interested. I think that is yeah. more funny. <laughs> you know, when they really yeah, pretend they're not interested, they're very like not yeah. bothered. I mean, you have that jacuzzi in your building. You have a jacuzzi in your building, man. I mean, it's a kid pool, to be honest. Oh, it's a kid <laughs> it's pool. not really a jacuzzi. <laughs> 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 Puneet, <Silvery. laughs> <laughs> Puneet, let's get off this podcast, yaar. It's not fair. Because these guys have too much money to pretend to be leftists. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even notice what a huge building society. That little yeah. pit is my building. My building is a little pit, right? Nothing else gives away the building. Everything else is fine. But that blue tarpaulin, no, that uh, that thing you see on top, yeah, that gives yeah. away the real state. Don't worry. Don't worry. That's bomb. Every building yeah. in Madhuri is like that now with repair work. So, it's no longer only 
many uh, slums they've carried. That is Bombay symbol and pride, I think. People yeah. should all have that at home. Yeah, when the flight uh, comes in, that's the first thing you see about Mumbai. All tarpaulin yeah. everywhere. So blue, like why is not this obsession? I always feel very uh, emotional when I see it. One, that thank God I don't have those things, and two, that I'm back home. I always feel that feeling. It's really sad. By the way, you guys were caught in the traffic jams at all. Or Abhi, what is the Monday? display picture of your? I I really need to know this. What is the display picture of uh, Sherwood Girls WhatsApp group? DP. I'll have to check with uh, Nidhi, uh, which is the, what is it? I, I'm for, for what I think it's some little fairy doing like some uh, you know with her <laughs> wand thing. If I'm not wrong, what was the brand? Think, yeah, yeah. No. What was the shoot is for? The WhatsApp. I don't know. Like I didn't like. I didn't actually go and you know indulge. You didn't go shopping. That, that uh, no, no. I was. See, that's the thing though. That's the transition when. You become the from the guy latching at the girl when you are more interested in looking at the other guys latching at the girl because that is comedy content. So, so yeah. that is the transition that happens. Yeah. Uh, in so you are still heterosexual, thing. but you are one generation below. Is what you are yeah. saying? It's you are understanding the the mindset of the other person. Like you are very close to Bakisha. We are seeing. Fair enough. Fair enough. So yes. yeah. he is becoming also, a humanitarian. Also, is not sharing a major life event that happened last week in his life. He performed for the first time in Kandivali. Who? Oh, wow. Congrats, man. <laughs> yeah, it was very interesting. <laughs> but uh, more than Kandiwali, like uh, you know, we uh, even Panya, uh, like pa- Parit, you, you were saying, you no, know, some he went for some Chennai show and uh, where everybody, every performer before his act, some music plays and they are supposed to do something. <laughs> and Puneet, because he's right now in his whole testosterone zone, he, he did push-ups on stage, <laughs> which is the most non-Puneet <laughs> Panya thing ever. <laughs> like I'm the whole comedy. Wait, how many? Like, how many were you able I, to do? I, that Puneet I, will I, save I, it. I, I but if he did too many, it. would be uh, be out of breath for the performance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Does like 20. Okay, guys. Okay. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Yeah. This is done for the day. Yeah, give it's it TikTok reel now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> to put the record straight, um, this was years ago. I'm performing in Chennai next oh. month in March. If you wanna come, you guys can come. But this was like four, five years back, and I was still working. So I had a full blazer on. I had just come down from the flight. I'd gone there for work, and in Chennai, everything is theatrical. No? So everybody puts on a song and dance. Even if it is not a song and dance show, so every comic coming up to perform had an entrance music playing. And they would come up on stage, and it wouldn't stop playing. You do a couple of steps, and then you perform. They did it for me also. So I, I had no steps. I still have no steps. I had two wooden legs. Okay, two. Yeah. Which you keep rubbing. Yeah. <laughs> no, no, but it's so called fanfare. Puneet, unfortunately, yeah. you comedians have become so communist that you don't like any fanfare. You want to come in all dry, and you know the world sucks, and then start talking with a bare mic. But, but it back feels in the weird, house, Cyrus. It feels it's weird, lovely. like. But because right we now also even in Delhi, right? I, I had a proper show and uh, like because Ajkal was <laughs> here, so Delhi made like this guy, uh, Gurgaon show, and this the organizer was like, sir, uh, like after the opening act, you have some music to enter. I'm like, uh, matlab, as in like you talk about gate music, like when people are entering and sitting, music like that. Like, no, no, no. Once the open host and opening act are done, then you are entering. You have some jatta, the chora jatta, the chora jatta, the chora ya AP Dilo pe ekdam enter karoge. And I'm like, I'm a wrestler. थोड़ी है एंट्री म्यूजिक Puneet happens at events all the time. It's not under your control. You don't rehearse the event, so yeah. you just come on and they say your name, Puneet Panya, and then discard, 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 and you got all the self yeah. 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 the self-deprecating jokes coming up. Dear, it's hilarious. Great fun. I sold one uh, ticket in Chennai from this podcast. Finally, one Tarun ticket already. Yes, Tarun yes. is saying he'll come for my show next month. Great. People around. People around. <laughs> What is the Indian men and dancing? From my generation onwards, I've never seen any improvement. Firstly, we only dance with other men. Secondly, it's all upper body and just stamping and jumping. There's no dancing. I think I think you can't dance if you're funny. I think that's 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 the thing. Maybe. If you just can't like, I have not seen a funny person dance go, be be a good dance. Hey, so, come yeah. on, you, you see Andy every week. Kevin Hart. Kevin Hart ah, is a pretty smooth sorry, dancer. Sorry, sorry, yeah, Panya. I just uh, I just realized there's yeah. there's this, aberrations are always there, but uh, yeah. yeah. So uh, but, actually, yeah. I wouldn't mind fanfare if we had the budgets. You could come in with the DX music and you know do this before the show starts. But would, I think <laughs> fanfare. Budget? I don't know about you guys. Oh God, that's so. Or oh, you put me in nostalgia now, man. Just think about <laughs> <that's laughs> degeneration. Excuse me. Talking about. The, Uh, great dancing, right? I have something to share with you guys. Like great oh, dancing. Oh no! Like, oh my god! <laughs> Finally, oh, Andrei so, coming out of the closet. Dancing. Okay, this is like, oh my god. dancing. This is Karunesh. That's me. <laughs> In oh, the that's office. You. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's his name. What is? 
That's what I mean. It's all upper body, you see. It's all upper body. It's fantastic. Yeah. It's all upper body. Yeah. yeah now he's giving us a pectoral display. Yeah. Pretty I'm good. Well done, see. <laughs> he's loosening up the shoulders. That's nice. So That's Jalak Diklaja is not going to call you. I don't know if the show is still on on Nasibaliye for a little while. We'll have to have a little higher standard for them to actually make that call. So be careful. <laughs> but but my big worry, I don't you guys. But you guys get Sorry. this a lot where you uh, are doing a show and they introduce you like your god. That is the worst because yeah. your actual yeah. belief. Most comedians believe we are failures. So I'm just thinking <laughs> that they come out and say he has entertained India, he has entertained Russia, he is here, he is there. Man, so half a film, two documentaries, one corporate event. You know, it doesn't make you like Kapil Dev of the fine arts. But they make you. They say all that, and then the pressure. You know, they're clapping for this great man in Chutia here. Ye kon hai? This is not Amitabh Bachchan. Who the fuck is this guy? And then you have to start from that back foot. It's embarrassing, man. Oof. Happens. The best okay. introductions have been done for me uh, by Anu Menon. Uh, Anu, uh, you know, for like, and Obviously. this is in Canvas. This is back in Canvas, and she, for some reason, uh, pro- did proper introduction of what she thought of you. So Anu, like before, he's a Bengali boy with some childhood issues, and he talks a lot about dicks for some reason. And give it up for Abhishek. Like, oh, don't do that, please. <laughs> yeah. So it was. Uh, yeah. Why do you think you, you talk about dicks, but uh, all the time? There must be a reason. I don't know. I don't know. I had probably one, one, one in homosexuality, joke, and that's the reason. That's the only one Anu heard in the previous days. So she was she picked How on me? it that this boy actually talks about that's, that's unfair. Yeah. That's really false advertising. You had only one. Dirty dirty joke in yeah, a 45 man. minute set oh, yeah, and, so and that day I didn't even do that and the whole audience seemed disappointed <laughs> but where was the dick joke dick <laughs> hai dick hai if you went Delhi they screwed you I went dick so now man I love Delhi I miss Delhi I haven't performed Delhi for so long it, it's oh, like you're, they, they, it, it's on remote for them sometimes they shout out if they watch you on YouTube oh they are oh, oh, karo, oh, karo. For, for musicians <laughs> it's horrible when you're anchoring shows for musicians the way they get treated sometimes hey so no oh my god <laughs> but this was happening to me in Kandi Valley also. <laughs> what happened? Yes, Sonu. Sonu, so no. So no. Like how? What, what happened? I mean, Kandi Valley, there was like, like very chatty, uh, you know, three, uh, one lady actually. And there were like three, b- b- three women over there. And uh, the two of them actually dissociated from the third one. Like, hai. she was just on and on and on. And I was, it's still fine. But, you know, the opening acts are like, you know, not that experience. So poor fellow, man, Atul got hammered by her, bajaud. Like she Atul was saying the meanest hai, thing. Hai, hai. Not Khatri. Atul Sharma Karke is a young boy. Uh, okay. And she was saying the meanest thing. Like, uh, nice. karado, to, like who was that poor oh, fellow? No. He was just like sweating and all. It was just so bad to see oh, that. No. Oh, yeah. But he didn't speak back I with should... her. He didn't have a back and forth. See, I mean, he he still, I mean, he's relatively new, no. So you get you know frazzled with when something like that happens. So he was uh, he was not able to like he was definitely not uh, yeah comfortable hearing all that. And poor it's fellow was just trying those jokes. I, no, I think he, yeah. if he has a lot of copy and the copy is in his head, then that's irritating because he wants to do his copy. Yeah. But if you're like yeah. me and you're lazy, I love when someone shouts out <laughs> because then we can kill five minutes. So like that. Exactly. Also, yeah. see, he's the he was the op- first host guy. So he in his yeah, mind is like eight minute time. Eight minute ke jokes sunane do na. Ab main baat karunga, so that's like one minute less of the jokes. So yeah. yeah. So his takeaway is the, these were the Sherwood girls of Kandivali West. <laughs> <laughs> you know, gals, not girls, gals. Yeah, gals. gals. Desperate gals. housewives saw Charco. <laughs> this show surround sound and get evicted from the building. You come to Sherwood, <laughs> look at that. Friday, girls are modeling, Saturday, boys are modeling, screaming, shouting, there's swimming pool separate for children, which is great because they pee in the pool. Let's be honest. All kids yeah. pee in the pool. This is a known fact. You've got to stop keeping children in the same pool. It's horrible. Terrible. Idea. I don't think it's just kids, by the way, but yeah. <laughs> hey, mera uh, those... adad nahi hai. Mera, uh, it's a, like a bimari. I can't control it. So please, you know, that <laughs> uh, for our listeners on audio, uh, Cyrus was referring to Ruben David's comments, which said. Uh, I need to reduce the volume. This show on surround sound can get you evicted from the building. But what do you want to understand? You're saying for audio and then you show the visual again, which they can't see anyway. I mean, yeah. But yeah, but <laughs> just to tease again, that's reference for the people who screen. are on video. No, it's a whole thing. Yeah, it's, it all feeds into each other. Okay, should we get to the next topic? Hey, but guys, why didn't one of you all do a, a stand-up routine only on stand-up? Like, 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 you know, stand-up itself is there's so much shit going on backstage. All this crap yeah, we're yeah, talking we about do. right now. Yeah, we yeah, we do. can. We, I have, I have done. All of us must be like doing like yeah. substantial of our like the crazy experiences we have had uh, yeah. while during performing in different different places yeah. been hilarious. In a Bhopal show recently, the guy who was introducing me forgot my name because he was so overwhelmed by everything. 
सर 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 कर रहा था and he said uh, coming up next is a great artist and then he forgot my name so i just came up on stage and he, then he said are sir to stage pe aa rahe sir aa rahe sir aa rahe and then he got down and i had to take a photo <laughs> has someone by mistake someone had a comment and reminded me has someone mistake called you putin panya instead of puneet panya <laughs> yeah this, this everybody say they put in a put in a a pun it you you, hey, you can use it no you, you put it <laughs> in a pun it i'm like ye kitni baar sunega like i don't even do puns अनबिलीवेबल बट इन वन अमरावती शो दोस्ट सेट की सर आ रहे हैं अभी और सर को आप डिस्टर्ब मत करना आप चुपचाप बैठना नहीं तो आपको चौक से के मारेंगे एंड दे एक्चुअली लिसन टू हिम एंड दे फकिंग डिन लाफ ओनली टू थ्रू आउट दिस बिकॉज़ सर मारेंगे आई वाज ही स्टैंडिंग बिहाइंड यू चौक इन हैंड ऐसा पकड़ के रेडी 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 फॉर एक्शन सप्लाई स्नाइपर सर सप्लाई देयर बट व्हाट वुड हेल्प इज अ गाय लाइक नसीर डिस स्टैंड अप बिकॉज़ आई हैव सीन शोज वेयर नसीर इज डूइंग लाइक चेक ऑफ इन ऑल वन मैन एक्ट्स एंड ऑल दैट वेयर द मोबाइल फोन हैज गॉन इन द ऑडियंस यू नो ट्रेन बजंग बंग बंग and he stops his act and he's like this seriously very very high floating english chekhov kind of play he stops in the middle of all that monologue and he says ek kaam kijiye phone uthao so that guy, that guy says hello everybody starts laughing aram se aram se tells him like all sarcastic but oh. that after that the whole audience was like we were scared because it was yeah. so intense the moment you know when he just spoke like that and he went back to his high floating english chekhov but fish man we were all shivering after that nobody the made a sound nobody clap nothing <laughs> the best a uh, phone uh, untimely phone ringing story i heard i don't know if i think uh, you might have also heard about this like is when uh, there was this shoot of amita bachchan going on uh, there there's this that's like mine. Uh, prop ha huh? that's your story the, the, yeah uh, because i heard it from Vic- i've heard it from vikram ji No, no, no. Vasan Valsan from uh, my Bakta producer. We were okay. shooting. Uh, you, you remember the Marvel shoot one, na? No? Which one? <laughs> yes, yes, yeah. yes, 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 yes. I'm yes, sitting yes, right yes. there, bro. I'll never oh, forget. Oh, it's your shoot. Oh, what yes, is the story, yes. though? I've that's, told you ten times. That's about when it. you know the story is no. viral <laughs> when it comes no, back no, no, to it, you. It, only. Yeah. it was so. It, these are the truths of life where you don't, you know, you don't know. It's surreal. You get out of that <laughs> moment. You can't believe it has happened. Because I'm a huge Amitabh fan. This is the mid '90s. You know, at a point where I have not met him, so you know, once you meet them, is a little easier. So you're, you're in awe yeah. uh, and all that, and we're sitting there, and they warned us that Amitabh can be in a bad mood. So whatever happens, make sure no sound. The shoot has to go seamlessly. And then Vasan says on the PA to all fifty people in the studio that sab log ka mobile phone off pay please, off pay, and all that nonsense. Gives a proper warning, and we start talking. At which point, ping 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 happens, and he loses it. Vasan loses it. Cut. Kis ka phone chalo hai? Kone wo madar shoot? And then he does. He said it in front of Amitabh Bachchan, whatever. And there's silence after three four beats. बुलेटिया <laughs> 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 I mean, oh, it was very scary. What a monster! Story. How many? Yeah. Oh, this. I was just talking about the story of Cyrus story. with Pachan. Yeah. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah. 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 See, that's how yeah. viral the story yeah. is. This viral story. What a great sense of humor. When you think of it, also, he could have he could have taken you know, Amrish and got angry or whatever. He could have done the whole, you know, how dare you? Or he could have just, you know, made a look at Vasant and the whole thing would have whatever. But he just it's decided to do this. It's a proper funny punch. It's a proper funny punch. It's a hilarious. Three second punch. beat, that was me. You're learning how to deliver comedy. Three second beat. I'm like, oh, I'm a Then he realizes the pitch silence. You know, like pin drop. Like you hear that phrase, pin yeah, drop. Perfect, Nobody yeah. wants to. Look or talk. Oh, mother! Cyrus, did you just use the word "umraj"? I have not heard that word since school. What word? What did? What word did I use? Did you? So use I don't listen to what um- I'm saying. Uh, my my work is all uh, basically is basically oral masturbation of sorts. You know, just <laughs> not really paying attention. <laughs> Silvery, how are you? Uh, I'm doing all right. I'm just. Uh, Waiting Going for when we get topics. Puneet <laughs> 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 yeah, is now discussing grammar and vocabulary. Yeah. We've gone from where to where. Puneet always does this. Puneet always stole my story. Who's the guy who stole our story? 
Then, uh, but uh, then he's a fan of your, your show, no? That that's why he, he got Bachchan right. He decided to put himself in the in the chair. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, no. But his story was not that he was there. His story uh, is that this happened. It's like how Delhi talks about Bombay. Na, pata hai, wahan pe na, aisa hua tha. So, <laughs> so yeah. Bro, we thought our careers were over. You have no idea, man. I, I, I couldn't believe it because when he pulled the phone out, I knew immediately. It says, you know, I, I was sitting right there. I'm sitting close to him. The idiot Vasant, and he only he doesn't use bad language so liberally like that. It was just the pressure. So this this oh. comment section is getting hilarious. <laughs> <It's all different laughs> now, <laughs> now, <laughs> Mr. Wayne, maybe maybe we should invite him on the show once yeah. and for all. Let's see how funny he is. Isn't Bruce pretty. Wayne a regular on this show? Even yeah. I remember the name. Yeah, yeah. Bruce Wayne has been around for a while. He's a very big fan. Phil Dunphy is in the chat today. Uh, we are going places, guys. Phil Dunphy, Phil Dunphy, from, Dunphy from, from Modern uh, Family. Modern oh, Family, yes. Great. Yeah, fun, fun. Excellent. <laughs> uh, yeah, Rohit Sharma, the modern family is, is talking to us. <laughs> yeah, big man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very cool. Yeah, yeah. All right. That's because I was trying not to make eye contact. That whole story. <laughs> I was not doing it to be arrogant. I was doing it because I didn't want yeah. to, you know, disturb him because he was. He always keeps his head down when he's walking in public. If you ever see him, he always keeps his head down so he doesn't make eye contact. So you get the body language. You leave him alone. What are you going to do? Just go go and hang yeah. out with him like it's Shole and you're on the bike. <laughs> it's not like that, bro. <laughs> So then he only said, "Yeah, the opposite of Pachana, comics. Pachana, no, Pachana, kya, Pachana, kya, Pachana, kya. Yeah. <laughs> Not like that. The delivery is always baritone. Uh, mm-hmm. Imagine if you're working in his house also. Mm-hmm. Master Radia. <laughs> he has already tried thrice to move to. Oh, so, yeah, yeah. Please go to your next topic. Sumit okay, and you are yes, interested. Puneet, Puneet, the Puneet is just waking up. He's a late night owl. So, uh. Uh, should we just take a break and be back with the topic? Then yeah, I'll tell you why stop moving the furniture. <laughs> why stop moving the furniture? This is this Don't is a big mean public. You should know your place. Take a break. <laughs> <laughs> Hey everybody, it's been another great week on the IVM Podcast Network. On this round is on me, Gauri talks to Janilia and Ritesh Deshmukh. They share how they gave up non-vegetarian food and started their plant-based meat venture, Imagine Meats. On Cyrus Says, Aisha joins Cyrus for their annual traditional Valentine's Day special. They debate who's the better parent, who's the better driver, who's the better haggler, and a whole lot more. On Hunt's Vani, catch the story of Bheem Tolaki Chokri. It follows the story of a young city woman who travels to the country to uplift the rural community population. On the Life Manifesto, Zarina explains how we can gather the courage to love again after being deeply hurt. And on Pulia Bazi, Pranay and Saurav debate whether a wealth tax can solve economic inequality in their series, Ek Sawal Kahi Jawab. Do follow us on social media. We're IVM Podcast on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and LinkedIn. And remember, if you're enjoying this show or any of our other shows for that matter, please do tell a friend. The word of mouth really helps. Also, don't forget to rate us on whatever platform you're listening to us and check us out on YouTube. You can check a list of all of our channels at ivmpodcast.com slash YouTube. And finally, we'd like to thank our sponsors this week, Bank of Baroda and HDFC Life Insurance. Thank you so much for making this possible. Abhijit? What's up? What do you think Hello. of our voiceover? Well, oh, the vo- yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Totally. I was uh, first, uh, first I saw it at Diljit Dosa and uh, yeah, I was just to somebody else. Okay, yeah. It was nice. It's uh, nice to hear Amit's voice always. Fabulous. It gets the yeah. higher yeah. value. I'm trying to promote him also. not getting the right response. Would you would you want him to introduce you, Puneet, at shows? Yeah, it'd be better than saying ki, uh, sir are sir aage hai, chok mat marna hai, sir. <laughs> <laughs> This is amazing. We want to hear Amit Doshi say. Yeah, that'd be. <laughs> yeah, that'd be. Na, nice. it will. Uh, yeah, it's. A, he doesn't. How about him? He doesn't think he was mad. Ha, mother chota. No, no, his Mother? accent stays. Uh, his whatever eighty percent American accent is there even in Hindi. I don't think yeah. it switches. It's quite. I'm just trying to think. Have I have I actually heard him say Hindi ever? Like, uh, yeah. No, like he'll say a, a word or two here and there. Yeah, like he won't I've never heard a full very sentence. Rarely, full, full sentence. Very rarely. Yeah, very rarely. Yeah. If he's like quoting someone, just, maybe you know. <laughs> do, do the impression. Uh, you do the impression of Amit. I mean, this is just, I'll get fired <laughs> right after this. <laughs> no, 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 he's very sporting. Come on. You're in the spotlight. Uh, Come on, do it, Silvery. Oh, oh, hello, hello, guys. What's happening? Uh, welcome to uh, Cyrus Says. <laughs> uh, yeah, but put the Hindi yes, impression I've ever heard. Cyrus, man. I was <laughs> telling you, I was telling you, Cyrus, that, you know, <laughs> Democrats are the worst kind of people that exist. <laughs> uh, they don't even like basketball, those assholes. No, he doesn't say assholes. <laughs> and good yeah. no, he does. When he's passionate, he says all kinds of bad language. But can you give us one uh, Hindi phrase Hindi that he would put in? Uh, what, what would he say? Uh, Mother Chod, no, sorry. <laughs> Mother Chod. That he won't use, but uh, Jugaad, uh, words that we use while talking, uh, you know, normal words. Like, yeah. uh, he, 
that's yeah, yeah. Similarly, which was yeah, that impression you. which was that impression that you nailed one in one episode like you did do a brilliant impression of somebody he does a very good silvery impression what do you hear that some norm some uh, chris norm, 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 norm yeah norm norm oh, norm, norm 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 i okay. i think it's the norm was bad norm, norm yeah. was bad that was the only yeah, one norm that <laughs> the only one that was decent somewhat amit and norm amit and norm together <laughs> he has got <laughs> that. <laughs> yeah, he's got that. We'll we'll you need the same presenter that Puneet had. Chup chup, sit down so that you know people listen to what you're saying. So, Puneet has a very thin voice. The problem with the uh, I don't like the part of the voice which is very deep. Both Amit Amit's voice is not very deep, and um, it's more lyrical, like a lyrical tenor. And Kunal's is very light. Actually, if you listen to his voice, it's not deep at all. So, Silvery, start Silvery. again. And action. Sab se ganda shabd hai action. Uh, All right yes. guys so uh, now let's move on to the next topic finally <laughs> that we teased kind of a little bit before the break and Horrible. uh here is uh, silvery i just about to share his screen before sarah starts talking again and uh, here we go okay so this is out of uh, faridabad okay faridabad now let the judges is... talk this is now indian yeah, idol yeah. let the judges talk abhijit ji aapko kaisa laga performance i just want to see the video actually yeah i actually want to see yeah. the video and poor audio listeners who are not able to see this but you can set it yeah. up a little yeah, bit describe it yeah, yeah i'm setting it up so faridabad we find out is in the last few days we found out that faridabad has some crazy people in it okay where uh, people living in buildings don't <laughs> realize that they're in actual buildings very line not uh, very pc I, carry on yeah i know But dude, people living in buildings in Faridabad don't realize. Doesn't mean that racism. Buildings. You know, my old Faridabad Because behaves like that, bro. You can't say these things. Yeah. You say, you see the video, and then you tell me. See the video, okay. and then you judge. Okay. Uh, this is a woman trying to collect the clothes that she has uh, dropped from her balcony to the balcony below. Okay. This is how she does it. Woman dangles son by sari from tenth floor to fetch clothes. <laughs> I can't believe it. <laughs> this guy. <laughs> So there's a there's a woman there's a whole family up uh, upstairs who is uh, dangling a sari and this kid is holding the sari and going down. What are the chances down. that this kid yeah. will one day be the CEO, uh, chairman emeritus of Amazon or you know Microsoft or something like that? <laughs> yeah, it's because he's an amazing uh, risk taker, the kind of guy who could yeah. really hit it out of the park. Wow, man, man, that, this is amazing. Tenth floor is is insane. It can't be your own son. It has yeah, to be. He he is adopted. I'm sure. But honestly speaking, uh, you know, from Haryana, if somebody is treating their sons that way, I think it's a progressive step. You know that uh, you know sons. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what do you, you wanted know? to say? If that's the way they treat the son, what do they do to the daughter? You no, imagine. She now you try without the sari. I did not say that. Huh? I did not. Shila, any who sari district it is? <laughs> But uh, yeah, the daughter yeah. has to survive for that to happen. No? My God! But wow, so that gives us a little bit of a picture of <laughs> very dark, right? Eh? So uh, yeah, I was saying this video gives us a little bit of a picture of wa- how crazy Faida Badians can be. Uh, we have one Faida more Badians. example. It's a good this. phrase, Faida Badians. They don't use it themselves. Arisa. But I'm Arisa, giving my Arisa, Kapoor, 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 Kapoor stays in Faridabad, no, and he tells yeah, these yeah. amazing stories of Faridabad that how uh, if you go to, like during the peak of second uh, wave also, like uh, they were like claimed was like they had twenty five uh, apartments with COVID people, but the chemist or next to them said, "Nee nee sir, डेढ़ सौ लोगों को है मेरे में हर में दवाई जाता है वो लोग बताते नहीं हैं बस so these are very <laughs> casual uh, Faridabad life is uh, just like that most Delhi goes there life is statistics what about yeah. UP UP is claiming that they are almost COVID free. <laughs> just, I mean, no one. UP yeah, had COVID. I don't think UP had COVID for them to be COVID free. Yeah. 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 Yogi yeah. put COVID in jail. Now it's not allowed. Oh, Shavik, Shavik is still better yeah, yeah. than Marol. Everything I, I, is better oh, than Marol, oh, man. Oh, <laughs> Everything. Oh, no. uh, yeah. Absolutely. I, I disagree. <laughs> I disagree. You just, you just like tasted Kandivli. You know what? Does, but like. does Marol have uh, post twelve o'clock? Does Marol have borders like take it open all the time where anybody can go? Like you know for sure that Marol will have a take it open. No, then Faridabad no. is better Marol because is Faridabad is <laughs> known for that. Marol has yeah. to close the borders at twelve o'clock. Otherwise, everyone will leave Marol. So that's the problem. It's <laughs> yeah. different. Yeah. If you perform at Marol, Silvery will never invite you on the show. Uh, yeah, that's true. But we, I actually used to do a comedy shows in Marol. Until we realize yeah. that nobody wants to come to Marol, and then we stopped. <laughs> wait, wait, wait! Police yeah. Marol want to get the fuck out. Yeah. Silvery uh, theory with theory with doing yeah. uh, organizing comedy shows is I will never organize a comedy show which is easy to locate. Uh, yeah, at, correct. At any venue, Absolutely. the venue Absolutely. always has to be a tricky one where you have to make like ten yeah. calls before entering and like try to like, find it. Like, yeah. Like, <laughs> third floor of some obsolete building, like <laughs> some, it's always it's all. But the room itself mandate. will always be surprising, huh? You it's have to it's amazing. Yeah. Room is great. Yeah, yeah that make, I have yeah. to give. If you make yeah. it, 
you will be rewarded because by then you are yeah. already so disappointed and dejected like last time i <laughs> performed at uh, silvery's room there was yeah. uh, like like people were ordering uh, swiggy se matlab uh, khana wana kar rahe the so there was a swiggy Which guy one? just bahar se aake hame bas aise kabhi vada pav pakda raha hai koi sushi aake pakda raha hai the audience show? members ka khana yeah during the show audience members are just yeah. ordering food and so we do bhai wo bhi shows was, We do yeah. BYOB shows there. Yeah. Uh, the audience can bring their alcohol. I can uh, drink and enjoy a comedy show with us. So yeah, but it was BYOB. Cool. It was Sometimes not uh, like make also. the comedians get the food. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. So that, that the, the guys case, are yeah. just coming and <laughs> uh, handing us our pots and everything. Is this the Juhu place? Silver? Is it? No, no, not Juhu. The Lokhanwala place. This is the Lokhanwala place. This is a Tassel, I think. Right? You're talking about Tassel, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was amazing. Last show, Silver. The show was fantastic. Last show I did with Silver. Half into my act, I realized there's a bird in the room. In the room. Cage. That was Arju. Feathers. that the yeah, parents yeah. in the room and they just talk yes, whenever the fuck they want <laughs> that's to. not how we are addressing so, girls yeah. <laughs> i thought i thought because <laughs> puneet ka show mein ladies nahi aate hai to you know i thought he was just as a funny one chick came i i went on a different those are those are those, those are pre push up days uh, cyrus now after oh, the push up yeah. you know being done on stage there is room for cyrus oh, we, we need women in the show who else will laugh guys don't come and laugh they just come and sit like this Like fucking yeah. Dukhi learns everywhere. We need women in the shows. Also, if women my, come, they'll get. I was doing a show. I allow all genders, huh? not just men and women. We must be very open now. We don't want to stop people. We're not in a position to stop people. Yeah, last time I was in Silvery's room, sounded wrong. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> true. True. Only Silvery's room. Sometimes it's Puneet and Abhijit performing together in my room. Uh, it's uh, wow. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It now we're just now we're just making. Let's call it a try or not a threesome. Yeah, Let's yeah. be very clear. But, uh, <laughs> it's, situational, it's, it's situational, guys. This ko jaisa. Okay. But Silvery, well, Silvery, so you produce the show. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So show? we, yeah, yeah. Me and I have uh, two other producing partners with me, uh, Kashyap and Mohit, and we produce uh, put up comedy shows. Producing uh, partner, right? It sounds intense. But yeah, there's yeah, a pair of the room plus two partners. Also. <laughs> it's already six men, and you're talking about birds. So obviously, I thought maybe finally a girl came in. No, oh it's a freaking parrot yeah, yeah. who's talking. Yeah. Parrot does her own stand up, but you're doing stand up. But can you imagine that? <laughs> and they yeah, prefer the parrot to the men. I'm fair. doing some you no know, big line, some big social economic statement, and I'm pausing for effect. Then he will say, "Hey, chutti, hey, chutti, hey, chutti." <laughs> 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 it's a good act. Yeah. You should keep the parrot with you. It'll bring the house down in certain I, I, places. I, I I train the bird to do that. Like oh, when Puneet pauses, <laughs> just go ahead. Yeah. So should we move on to Silvery's second video? Yeah. No. Sorry, second video. Ah, second video. Jaldi se. Uh, you guys can now so we'll be able to see my screen. Farida Bad is the yeah. Sohail Khan of NCR family. That was a good line. Yeah. Uh-huh. Audio people are not so, getting. Uh, There's another Farida Bad video. There's a, a dude uh, exercising. Yeah. This is the dude. This is the dude. Oh, He's wow. exercising on the outside of his balcony. What is that exercise, but it, I don't even <laughs> know what's the exercise. What is the what? same stretch he can do inside? Huh? Which muscle part is this? The same part. Yeah, exactly. There are two sides. He can do the same thing. <laughs> Why? Is, like what? What is, Why it? is he doing? Like a mini lunge. Is he a burglar who's not able to get in? Like, yar, chadu kaise main? Upar kaise jaun? I want to ask. Kya karu? We should check check his wow. qualifications uh, <laughs> academics. You think fourth standard <laughs> drop out? <laughs> why is there a why is there a guy why is there a red circle required? Everybody knows where you have to look in that video. <laughs> uh, there's a woman advising him. The coaches come, coaches come. Better do or do or keep going. Kishan, Mash, keep going. Oh, now she's told him that you can do it from the other side also. Not a problem. Yeah. It's probably yeah, a kid. It's probably the same building, yeah. It's the kid who's the father. My turn next. It's the kid's father. Sorry, sir. I'm going down. Abhi ji, wo father hai, baap hai unka. So obviously, you know, the whole family is fantastic. Well, well. Maybe it was the father. Are there monkeys, Abhi ji? Are there monkeys in Farida Bar? We cover the sari. Yeah, yeah. I like the story spirit more. Silvery, this, uh, hire this act for your show. This yeah. father and son duo. You just need a first, second floor set construction issue. But on, on stage, off stage, on stage, off stage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, oh, Puneet, uh, they all saying that you become the huge exerciser and all that. Uh, three hours in the gym every day, then <laughs> two hours. Oh, Cyrus, two you, hours. Have come, you have to come. You have to come for Puneet show right now. Puneet is just putting himself out in the market. Is like all. Wait, come on, show your now, like, physique. Let me see. Huh? No, this is. Legs, I'm not legs. getting paid enough for this podcast <laughs> to do that. <laughs> so, so are you one of those comics who takes off his clothes on stage and all that, or not? Or oh, that's another show no, altogether. Oh. No, that is uh, Papa CJ. I mean, it used to be. And, Papa, uh, so he takes off his clothes. 
Yeah, and and very recently, one producer. Uh, there was, like, I mean, in, in his defense, the shows like the concept show. It's not like randomly yeah. in the middle of a good joke. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. The show's yeah, name is Papa CJ Naked. <laughs> and, yeah, it's like, I mean, there's a whole message around that. I'm trying to un, uh, you know, yeah, ravel my th- things and all that. It's not like suddenly it's like boxes <laughs> down and so like wow. let's get busy, girls. <laughs> 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 then music plays. No, it's not pow, like that. Pow, but, uh, pow. <laughs> Recently, a venue owner was like sitting with me and uh, of all people, uh, Manik was there. Okay, and I I can't reveal the city name for security reasons. Oh, you're saying Manik like everybody on the, on the show is Manik's uh, girlfriend or boyfriend? Yeah. Who's Manik? Uh, Manik's a building for me video. in Malabar Hill. So who's Manik? <laughs> yeah, he's a comic. He has one video out which has 25 million views. So so I'll, let me tell you now. If you're saying Seinfeld, then we get it immediately. With due respect, huh. Manik is not yet Seinfeld. So you know. <laughs> Let's try again. Okay, he's, Manik, a, he's, he's, a, he's a reclusive Delhi comic that should suffice. Okay, yeah. So we are sitting with a venue owner uh, at a city that I can't disclose for security reasons. Rhyme, and, rhyme uh, it, rhyme it. Just give us a rhyme. Ah, uh-huh. like it's indoor. It's like bad door. Like you know uh-huh. something like yeah. that. Yeah. It's, it's yeah, probably that. So uh, it is indoor. <laughs> it's bad door. <laughs> Don't give it away. He's <laughs> scared to mention indoor. Said. So the it's owner is a comedy. Is, he's, he's a comedy he's fan. A he's a comedy fan. Oh. He, he knows all the comics. He's seen all the comics and all. And many that statues of the five other people yeah. who got like they, they made house. it to the statue level. <laughs> Poor fellows. So, like yeah. He's saying, "One was that one old comic. His name was what? That was very good. He was good. His name was something Papa Jones. Tha, Papa Jones. I said, "Oh, Papa Jones, not Papa Siej." <laughs> he honestly thought his name is Papa Jones. He makes a lot of pizza. 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 He What's the story been? Why is he Papa? It's like I have no idea. Like a rapper, him, not a comedian. You know, I understand if you're a rapper, you have a name like Papa CJ. So some people, people like to be called, you no, know, Daddy and all that. So maybe something like that. Because nobody will. <laughs> nobody nobody wants to be called Papa and nobody. <laughs> Because it sounds weird. It sounds weird to see a Chirag Jain taking off his clothes, probably. So I guess, yeah. man, I'm just imagining now in bed. Like, yes, Papa. Yes, yes, Papa. You know why is Papa in so bed much. with you? Just Papa. Yeah, imagine if the show yeah, is great. People like to be called daddy. Oh, no, no, no. People like to be called daddy. It's be very weird. It's fine. Let's not make judgment. Leave it. Leave it. Yeah. I mean, that's every time I'm on the show, not, it's either <laughs> it's either Kangana is kissing nephews or it's definitely <laughs> some weird some weird things going on on the show. Yeah, this time blame Puneet. Oh, He's setting it up all the time. It's not my fault. Yeah, man. For some <laughs> like, reason. Yeah. Happy we were talking about Puneet. Like where did this? I got nothing to lose. All your other comics are so scared all the time. Yeah, I've had more, more, such nice experiences of what is that called paragliding uh, in Faridabad back in the day. Yeah. Faridabad, great fun. Are you sure That's it was paragliding or it was just some balcony <laughs> chatter <laughs> that you were? I had no idea about the safety and all that. The MPB just put us there. Somebody was put us in a jeep. So first time you're scared because you go flying in the air and all that. But the second time you're super confident. It was the fifth or sixth time when I fell badly. Then I realized that boss, this is horrible. But, See, they uh, never have confidence issues. That thing is for hmm. sure there. They will no, never no. have confidence. They never no, have no. safety issues, but no when confidence. When they're tapping you, they don't even talk to you. They're talking to each other. That's the yeah. kind of, you know, you feel very confident when they're, it's a mundane work for them. Like, yeah, you know, it's like the guy who's checking your security. He's always talking to his friend when he's holding your groin. Oh, they're going to retire. And you're like, finish with that area, man. Just, you get on with it. But, but, so the same feeling happens when these guys are strapping you. I get really scared when they strap the abdomen area. So the same feeling happens when these guys are strapping you. I get really scared when they strap the abdomen area. Because I'm thinking, what kind of spot is this that you have to put this harness here and all? And, and but they were body language was great. And then by the fourth or fifth time, you feel so confident because you're coming down peacefully. Everything is good. And then the fifth time, you're you're like a Delhi tourist. You put your hands up. You're doing you know you're doing you're doing your dance and everything. And then you land. And then suddenly you go somersaulting. And then your back is hurt. Very For me, scary. Some, somewhere it got mixed. And where you're talking about the security guy checking your groin area and where it what the I have a huge problem with the like security them. guards at airports. They always stop at your middle area. You know, they always stop in the groin area for some reason. Ha, ha, I always argue with the hands. How 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 high do you keep your hands? I always keep them I just, just below my shoulder. Would it be amazing for you to get and to know if it, that problem just? Well, I don't understand. Why I have to put my hands <laughs> up? Like, <laughs> uh, yeah. No, but, but, but why do you put your hands up? He wants to now just search, right? So just keep the hands around. Around. Like, why? No, Cyrus. Now they ask you to turn around also. After they're done in the front, yeah. they say "Goom Jai." Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Hey, but yeah. have you uh, have you ever had that like early morning flights when they make you do it? I just end up yawning. So like. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love the Enthu <laughs> Cutlet. Do you know Enthu Cutlet, regular traveler who wants to show how well he knows the system? He puts hands up like, yeah, immediately fully up, stretched body, everything. It's amazing. It's I've even high fived. I've even high fived a fellow security check by guy neck. Like I was this, and the other guy was this, and we were turning and we high fived each other. <laughs> so that was like we shared a moment. Like it was very nice. <laughs> Was Cyrus actually went skydiving in Faridabad? Did what? You, did you like? Not skydiving. It's paragliding. So they tie you to the jeep, oh. and then the, uh, the, oh, the they wait for the wind, and then you ah. go flying up into the sky as the jeep most, goes this way. Most Faridabad stories end at tying at the jeep. Tying you at the yeah. jeep. Yeah. In the old days, <laughs> that it would end. Cyrus, yeah. did you yeah. you dropped your clothes at a distance and get them back? Oh, okay, I get it. Uh, well, are you sure they were even idea. trying paragliding, or they were just tying you at the jeep, and you just had something, Look, and that just made MTV it? MTV had no budgets, no ratings, <laughs> no shows to speak of. So this is what they did to entertain themselves. I don't know. These very strange guys strapped us up and had conversations among themselves. Ah, Bunty, kya hale? Ah, kya hale? Do aap batao? Aap batao? And they were having this conversation for five minutes. And I'm just standing there like a joker. Next thing, they tell me, "Don't worry, don't worry, kuch nahi hoga." And then, boom! For five seconds, you're just flying in the, the little free falling feeling. Then you're okay, you go up, and you're like a parachute of sorts, and you come down. The real fear is only that fall when you actually fall down, but suddenly it can become rapid. So if you want mm. to try it, I'm just saying, just be a little careful. Don't squat that day, Puneet. Your knees and all will be, you know, not in good shape. So be a little careful. <laughs> but none of you have done paragliding. What the? F- and you're a Delhi boy. <laughs> no, because no Delhi person it, in right too. mind is going for paragliding in Faridabad. That's what we know. Yeah. That's like, it's that's called suicide attempt. <laughs> How you kill us? <laughs> I yeah. done it in Kamshet, which is known for paragliding. You have not exactly. lived in Faridabad. You just lived in Faridabad. You have to he live. has lived. He's alive uh, to talk about it. He's a Bengali yeah. man. He's he's well well Sorry, aware of Bakshi. the fact that so you're not as a Bengali man, this. he said, "I'm not going to try this." <laughs> MTV Popat. Popat in Marathi means something totally different, by the way. So we yeah. should not get into that. That's disgusting. Yes, that's Let's do the M is. When he, when yes, you said MS. MTV has no budget, so first second I thought you were talking about M- NDTV. I guess so. Uh, it's anything that ends with TV. Eventually, they start having less budget. NDTV had a lot of budget. Yeah, I don't know if you remember those were yeah. the days when they had no political issues, etc. Et and also, they were flying high, and yeah. we really didn't have budgets. Trust me, let me tell you how we used to work. They put us on that six o'clock red eye flight because it's twenty five percent less, and they put us back on the ten forty five flight. It was a ten forty five, remember? And because it was twenty five percent less, so if you work two hours, you have to wait till the ten forty five flight. And sometimes you you do not you know for two three hours we are driving all the way from Noida to the airport trying to get in time for the ten forty five flight because they put everything into that day. They really made us suffer. You guys have lived like five stars. Did you ever go to like? Life, did you get no ever go to like proper Delhi, or was it always Faridabad or Noida? <laughs> or like no, no, no. Some, I, like Delhi. Was there any project in Saket or Vasant Kunj? No, they, the worst part is we stay in Delhi proper, so everything was a drive. Okay. Uh, either we are going to Haryana or we are going to UP. Please, you don't understand my life in Delhi. I was just rogered because everything is one and a half hours and two hours, one and a half hours and two hours just in the bloody car. Yeah, uh, my Hindi used to improve in three days. It was four and a half hours just chatting with the crew. And, oh. I don't, Cyrus. Are you even think this? Are you even sure this was a legit thing? Because we have had three comments. I've lived in Delhi. Faridabad has no place for paragliding. Everybody saying. That. I swear on my mother. Has, I swear. You're the only you're person who has experienced this, bro. Not only we did it more than once. It's like we, we did it many times. I'm, I'm that stupid. I never said no. <laughs> we even did it with a camera on my head. You, you know, you put the you GoPro and all that. that. You are basically that child who's being lowered into the balcony. <laughs> that was you some years back. <laughs> until, like, yeah, Nikhil no Chinapa, <laughs> until Nikhil Chinapa joined MTV and he had, you know, uh, rights and issues and wanted rules and regulations. I had no idea you could say no. <laughs> so, you know, I was just doing what they said. And they, in fact, I spoiled everyone because, you know, they thought all the VGs will just listen now. They'll go economy yeah. class. They'll stay in a two-star hotel. They won't give any trouble. They'll carry other people's bags. And then suddenly, all the other ones came and they were like, boss, balls? I mean, uh, Sophia would like, I don't like this hotel. Change the hotel. I was like, you can't do that. Oh, I mean, can you do that? I don't know you could do that. <laughs> it's just not fair. Yeah. yeah, so it was. It, it really was a very sad period the first couple of years. Uh, no, no, no. Yeah, I, I wish I had doing doing that, that one. Time. I wonder. Uh, NDT don't do this. Was but doing very drinking well and going on paragliding. No, 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 Sabi. That was not Cyrus. That was the guy instructor of the paragliding thing. That he was a lot of drinks down. Yeah. Bro, so. incidentally, there have been some uh, accidents and all that, and it's all in the landing. So, Incidentally, of course, there have been a lot of accidents yeah. in Faridabad paragliding. There's no real. They put you in a harness. There's this is all a wind factor. It's just science, right? Now, if that wind drops, 
Okay, the wind exactly. that they're creating by with the distance of the jeep, <laughs> that is not enough. So, so at the end of the day, the wind drops, it drops. So you sort of lose. Are you sure you know? this was paragliding? Because every line you say they put you in a harness, it sounds like a failed kidnapping attempt. <laughs> I don't know. It's a mixture of S and M and them trying to get rid of the old VJ. I don't know what it was, but I did it. <laughs> I did it. One of my colleagues, one lady, who wanted to do it, wasn't allowed because she was over ninety kilos. So they had some safety oh. restrictions. That's yeah. shaming, eh? I know. Real issue back then. And she wanted, you know, she was one of those people who likes doing all this. I don't. I was just killing time and I didn't know I could say no. Uh, 100, 200, the other, let me do This is that video. <laughs> yeah. Guys, shall we do uh, the, this thing? I've got this to do one news article the, for my gig. Do you like true crime stories? Do you like to learn about the people behind some horrible, awful crimes? More specifically, women that may have committed these crimes. Actually, Indian criminals that are women? Then we'd like to welcome you to our podcast, Misconduct. My name is Raghavi and I am Nisha. We cover themes like murder, decoity, drug trafficking, financial fraud, kidnapping and many more. You can catch us every Wednesday on the IVM Podcast Network or wherever you get your podcast. Follow me at Instagram and Twitter on Bored Brocha. I'm so bored, I need your help. I need your love. I need your touch. Okay, just, just, just follow me. Let's do, let's do AMS. AMS. Uh, first one comes from Mittu Chaudhary. Mittu Chaudhary asks, uh, recently moved to Delhi from Bombay. Survival hacks, please. Be drunk. Okay. Ganguly. Drunk all the time. Yeah. 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 Uh, know who your father is all the time. Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, by the answer way, ready. That's, that's, answer the biggest, that's the wrong worst stereotype I've ever heard. Like, yeah, 29 years, 30 years living in Bombay. I've oh, never heard that line to Janta Mira Bapkona except from Bombay people. Only Bombay people have said this. <laughs> I've, I've never actually also. heard this line. I have never no, heard I have seen a fight. Because you were probably hanging out with another Bombay guy. So yeah. Maybe. I have seen a fight in Vasan Vihar. <laughs> Vasan Vihar proper between two cars who got out. The guy who was doing the most shouting, he took off everything like he's like a professional wrestler. Bracelet Nikala. <laughs> good. Watch. It's like a bracelet or a ring. Oh, he took out everything for five minutes like a warm-up. I was laughing so much. And then of course it, it happened. They started pushing, you know, Indians fight. Pushing, pushing. It all started. It's great Nobody fun. Nobody actually hates. Yeah, that's true. No, no, the full gali galoch, all it was lovely. I, I, but uh, I, Mittu, for this, uh, we need to know where like, exactly you're staying because the survival hacks for South Delhi and North Delhi, East Delhi, West Delhi are very different and obviously different from Faridabad. Just don't let anybody hang you or harness you and stuff like that. They Say tie no. you to a what, Maruti what? gypsy, which is obsolete. Remember, that's the sign that things are going wrong. Yeah, it's <laughs> yeah. going a little wary. Yeah, like it's yeah. Just, just get a metro card and don't buy anything from CP. Hey, type grip on your belongings. Or I don't think it's it's not like. Have you ever felt Abhijit? It's not like Delhi or getting pickpocketed every. Five I think Bombay is worse for that. Crowded Bombay. I mean, uh, I have never had pickpocketing experience in Delhi, but uh, <laughs> Bombay <laughs> may be <laughs> new. I mujhe to. So I, I would assume that. I think they'll put uh, something in our pockets. Out in fact, the only place station. where I felt really scared was uh, when I was in Europe because everybody kept saying that pura chori ho jata hai, pura chori ho jata hai. And I saw in front of me also, like, ek ah, yeah, yeah. Be like there are just people who bump into you, Barcelona and all those places. So I guess uh, Delhi or uh, Bombay or India is safer than a uh, lot of these uh, European yeah. fancy. I cities. think Abhijit is very touchy. He's all thanks to Modi ji. Delhi nationalist. Yes. He's all thanks to Modi ji. He's abused Spain. He's a Spain king. But it is true. Barcelona or Spain is a very real legit. Florence, mein, like my wife, uh, yeah, very, very very story ho gaya pura. Like, and that was yeah. also because of little bit of. Just a Real Madrid supporter. <laughs> there must be a reason in footballing reason to this, and that's why Barcelona is getting. You're a Real Madrid supporter, I'm saying, and there must be a reason to why the Barcelona bashing is happening. It's no, always no, no, coming no. down to sports. Yeah. But uh, in general, uh, okay, fine. <laughs> see, but, see no. exposed. Oh, superb, <laughs> superb. <laughs> no, no, but uh, yeah, sure. Uh, my wife Nidhi's bag, uh, you know, it got stolen because slightly. I would say it's. Was slightly like, yeah, like it's her let's, fault. Let's hey, story. Come on. I'm I'm her her fault. Fault. I have to leave in four minutes. Please, please, stay fast. It's her fault. If I say it, I think we'll get in trouble. So that's why I don't want to say it. No, no, no. <laughs> like, we'll apologize. Because we'll apologize Florence, now and then. apparently all these European cities, there's a huge uh, pickpocketing. This getting stolen. Like any moment, like people can like yeah. steal you, and it's happened in front of also. So Nidhi was very cautious about. Uh, you know, careful about Kimiko Chori Nikan. And there was like this bag she was wearing. And uh, she she always used to keep it in front. But uh, we were traveling by the bus over there. And uh, there was like three, four group of, uh, you know, very nice, but 
Uh, you know, black gentleman, oh, oh, you know, in front of us. Sorry, bro. I would have stopped you. Yeah, you have to wait. You have to wait. Where does the story end? Where does the end? Where does the end? They are very nice. They are nice. Yeah, and the uh, you know, poor thing. She has, you know, she. I mean, it's a. I mean, you can't really blame her like for having apprehensions and the, like this group of three, four. Uh, you know, and uh, it's called stereotyping. Yeah, exactly. I know yeah, it's not it great, but I'm <laughs> I'm saying so. She that's why she put the bag behind her and पीछे से कोई चोरी करके ले गया. So yeah, so it was a lesson given that never stereotype like back then. So yeah, so. Uh, and a pickpocket doesn't leave their color of their skin as a calling card for you to know. Yeah, I I I, I, I agree know. with everything. Yeah. So, but yeah, but oh. also also, मेरे को एक ये भी बात like I should not say this story. Ah, uh, but no, no, I'm not. Beards at the airport. Come on, don't stop. You're on a roll. <laughs> bolo, bolo, bolo. <laughs> no, so the thing is that uh, we were when we were yeah, we, uh, when we were there. Sorry, this will be uh, the bell has just rung. So while <laughs> Nidhi, Nidhi, that's the wife. Yeah. Hi, Nidhi. Oh, that's that's your that's, Nidhi can't hear. No, that's that's your racist wife, Nidhi. Sir, it's wow. Like, थिंग यू ट्राइंग टू यू नो लाइक smoke or uh, do bo something like that because in europe it's racism, legal it's I legal you can go europe. with the dope don't worry <laughs> <laughs> so uh, and so i had asked some people that uh, you know how how do you source this uh, you know things over there and people had told me that yaar kisi park mein ja aur i'm just going to say it out guys uh, or <laughs> And again, it is okay. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> bit, I got it. I know. No, certain, <laughs> you know, ethnicity. Look, I, I, uh, I, Nidhi, so, never allow on the podcast. Put it so, down. Blacklist. 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 So, oh, sorry. Like, what? More dealer. Ho sakte. To more dealer honge. So, you know, they can uh, help you with uh, stuff. And uh, I'm like, yeah, ye kaisi ghatiya baat hai. And I told this to my friend that this is just a bad <laughs> stereotype, and this is just racist, and this is so shitty. But then I was in Madrid. <laughs> And I was going through a park, and this black guy. You want to stop, Abhijit? You want to stop for you? And then he's like, "You want some?" Let him and go. Like, let him go. It's true. <laughs> so yeah, I'm just no. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Yeah. Bro. No, but that's but see, see, but if, it's way, true, <laughs> if it's actually <laughs> true, if it's actually true, it's like Abhijit saying. If it's actually eye. a black person a who is a dealer. If that's yeah. the person who is a dealer, then it's not your fault, right? If you're it, not the one, exactly. It was a bad person, and I did not no, even no. make eye contact. That's why I looked at me. Exactly. The guy looked at me. I looked at him, and then he came up to me. He's like, yeah. "Do you want?" And I'm like, "Wait." Uh, look, I guess there is a reason. Looked at me. Or a guy. If he told the story without the preamble, he look for this and all that. It's a little different. Then it's just what happened, and incidentally, the man is of this color or this ethnicity. But he told the story with the premise that this is what you have to do, and then that's what happened. So no, I did I not. This is what I have to do. I was Gangoli. told by a friend who was no, cancelled. <laughs> you were cancelled. No, we have tried. We have tried. Sorry, Abhijit. Your wife can never do stand up now. Your wife cannot attend stand up also. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> my God. Yeah. Nice person. Otherwise, very sweet. Yeah. Yeah. My wife is asking me why we shot him. My wife is asking why we shot him. Because his wife is racist. Abhijit, one of our leading comedians, is telling us stories about how his wife has racist views and stereotypes. Hello. Don't wave to them like they are children. But no, she's. You have racist views. Puneet and I still have some careers left to salvage. Please, there's enough problems. No, no, don't have racist views. Go away. Go away. Which reminds me, I have to go. Silvi, can I leave? One, one quick one. Fast, fast. Quick, 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 quick. Last question is comes in from Phil Dunphy. Uh, from Warren Family, he says, uh, "Hi guys, huge fan of the show. Phil Dunphy is a fan of the show. Yeah, he says, uh, he's a white guy, guys. Just by the way, yeah, well, yeah, that's true. Yeah, Phil Dunphy. Uh, don't you feel the Indian team of late has been quite weak in terms of batting? Miss the days when scoring a hundred from the top four batsmen was the norm in every match." You are talking about playing against all relativity. If playing against the West Indies batting, I mean, you need eleven runs. You make eleven or twelve, you are going to win the game. You don't need more than that. So yeah, it's just ridiculous. But I think he's talking about red ball cricket, where we've not got some big centuries. I think only KL Rahul and Pant got a hundred towards the last test of the South African series. Abhijit, hey, Koi Jawab? Yeah. Are we not? I mean, yeah, Virat Indian batting has definitely come down. Virat two years plus no hundred. Yeah. Virat no hundred. Ajinkya no hundred. And the worst, the most painful part is. 
we are not able to play spin like that was something that we grew up on of abusing spinners and not even treating them with any kind of respect that's something that we grew up on and suddenly that was a stereotype this, most yeah. spinners were brown skin in the old days yeah most, and uh, your wife would have pointed that out brown skin spinners <laughs> <laughs> just imagine like we made like Dark indian art. batsmen used to make shane warne and all feel like part time spinners and now Against South Africa, they are making part-time spinners feel like Shane Warne. It is you know like, who yeah, that's uh, Shane Warne said was the most difficult batsman to bowl to for him. Sidhu, yeah. not uh, Sachin, not Rahul, not Lakshman, not Ganguly, Navjot Singh Sidhu. Sidhu, huh? yeah, yeah, mm. Sidhu. Sidhu was the first guy who just smashed him out of the. Dominated place. him from the first ball. Yeah, and now is dominating yes. Punjab politics from whatever corner for some reason. Is he? Yeah. Is he? Though? Not really, <laughs> but you <laughs> never know. He's still in the game. Yeah. 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 Okay, ladies, can I go now? I have to pick up my daughter sure, and rush sure. to Alibag. For an okay. appointment. Sure, yes. Yes. All right. Bye, guys. Uh, Bye, all those were just we are all one story. under God's eyes, yeah. and there is no color bar on this show. Absolutely. We love all yeah. colors. And the views of somebody's is wife is somebody's wife. It's not Abhijit's views, right, Abhijit? <laughs> yes, gals. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Sherwood gals. <laughs> Sherwood gals. Sorry. Nineties. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I'm coming. See, gotta go. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. Guys. bye. bye. Okay, catch us on any of the podcasting apps, please. We beg you, we need you. Send us your questions on Twitter on Cyrus Says In, or you can email us, even if you're not female, on what Cyrus Says at Gmail dot com. Are you looking for finance products and services that can enhance your personal finance experience? Are you looking for a space to talk about your financial product or service? And are you looking for a crisp talk show where the conversation is all about money? Well, your search ends here. Hi, my name is Anupam Gupta, and I'm host of the Pesa Pesa podcast. And I invite you for the conversation about your personal finance on each Monday on the IVM Podcast app, or the website, or on any podcast streaming platforms. See you, folks. A wise man once said. Traveling, it makes you speechless, then turns you into a storyteller. Well, listen to such travel stories and experiences exploring India on the Musafir Stories with us, Saif and Faiza. Catch us on the IBM website, app, or wherever you get your podcasts from.